The time is 11.58, so it's actually not morning, it's actually lunchtime. Speaking of that, Archie needs to eat. Look at that tail wagon. That's that royal canine. He is happy. If you guys don't know yet, this is Archie. He's our four month old today. No. Not until the 26th. Not until the 26th, but he's going to be four months on the 26th. He's a, he's a meanie dachshund. He's a chocolate dapple. He's never wondering his coat. Everybody, sorry about me. You look beautiful, but don't worry. Everyone always, you know, always calls him out because of his coat. It's really nice and unique, and it's strongly doubtful. Because you're wondering, we need dogs in purebred. They're very smart dogs, but you know, you have to take very good care of them. They bark a lot. Go into the comments and tell, uh, to let my girl know that she looks beautiful. So, on today's adventure, we are going to a little town called Friends, Oregon, and this little town is like 15 minutes away from Dufer, Oregon, and right now we're at the River, Oregon, it takes like 45 minutes to get to Dufer, so we're gonna head there, and I didn't explain friend, uh, Friends, Oregon too much, but Friends, Oregon is an abandoned town. I don't know when it kind of like became like not a thing no more. Like the, the buildings are still standing, supposedly the general store is there, the, the church is there, and I don't know, it's Sunday's boring day, and so we want to go for an adventure, right babe? Yeah, and like those type of towns are pretty cool too. Yeah, it's really cool. I like uh, just wondering like, you know, who was here, who walked around here, like was it, like it was busy at one point, it was an actual town and to like to think that it's just completely abandoned is crazy because it's like if the river was to completely be abandoned, like, yeah. Yeah, it'd be the remnants. Isn't it crazy? Mm-hmm. Right. It's going to be super cool. It's going to be cool for photos. Yeah. Alright, cool. So we're going to get some coffee, so we'll catch you in a bit. What's up? Are you so happy? He's all like, we're gonna get some coffee, Dad. Ah! So we're here at Starbucks, but I feel like Starbucks is so inconsistent with my orders that like I've lost hope. With any coffee shop around here, like I don't really have time to go to the coffee shops anywhere. Just because you don't get up early enough. Yeah. We should get up earlier. Enough. I do. It's just like you make me the coffee as like that I oh, like. That's true. Yeah, I'm your, I'm your favorite barista. Cause like I get like this, um, the cold Starbucks medium rose cold brew like from the store, and then I get like a creamer, and I just do that every morning. And like obviously, I wake up on time. You're just like, <laughs> calling me out, anyways. But that's like so much better than me coming to Starbucks and like wait, like having to actually like you know wake up extra early to make a stop and then tasting it and it not be what you want. And not being able to go back because you don't have time. You know? So it's just like, you know, very annoying. So right now I just got a caramel macchiato, which I haven't gotten in a long time. I haven't gotten in a long time. Also. Yeah, and I got two extra pumps of vanilla because it's. I didn't want to get extra caramel because I'm not big on caramel, but I like caramel. Thank you. Hey, babe. Hey. Are you a crew brother? Yeah. You <laughs> Thank you. He's all like, she's like, you look like crew. Oh, you guys look alike, and you're like, thank you. <laughs> I'm over here. It's a compliment to be looking like my brother, I guess. Oh, and then he's like, like I don't you. look like him. Yummy? Have you tried it yet? I haven't tried it. I'm like, Archie, like, you need to calm down, bro. You can't have coffee, or else you'll get the shits. I'm gonna get the shits. Damn. <laughs> hey, how about you calm down, buddy? We don't need any of that. We don't need any of that. Damn. What's up? No, you probably need to stir a bunch. Like, all the way until that white's gone. Archie. What's up? Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Damn. Oh, camera, camera. Not both oh, of us vlogging. <laughs> you ready? Should we send it? Huh? Should we yeah, send yeah. It's just up the road up there now. Yeah? Yeah. How it, far is it from so, I think it's like 30 minutes. It's minding no business. Where is it at? It's in Dufer. You'll see it's only like 15 minutes away from here. Let's do it! Oh. On the road. We move in. Ghost Town Adventures.
The Suvi. Ouch. Oh, What's up? Suvi versus Suvi. Yeah, You're looking a little camera. slow over there, bro. What's up? You it's because, you know, I got to balance my tires. <laughs> <laughs> so we met it here to Dufer. We're here at the, what's called the Kramer's Market. We're going to go in here and pick up some snacks. Huh? I'm telling them about like, it's cool. It's actually really nice. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. Considering like we're like it's a doofer, it's actually like really nice. Yeah, it's nice. I fuck with it. Waiting, waiting in la cola, ya sabes. Ya sabes, yeah. Got some mm. che, corn nuts, some Pringles cheddar cheese. So some water and some Pringles salad, I cream and onion. How are you doing today? Good. What you taking pictures of? Are you the one with the camera? Oh, no, I'm the one with the big camera. Well, we're both having have cameras. Oh. Yeah, I'm just gonna go check out the town, see if, if it's still there, right? It should be there, right? Connection um, failed, so... Uh, I don't know. There's not a lot out there. There's not a lot? Well, I guess I'll let you guys know. What's that? B Doritos BD Spicy Crunch? BD? No. 3D Pendri. Oh, oh my god. 3D. <laughs> Bro, that, that shit kind of like it killed, got me on excited, bro. I was all like, damn, we're gonna go check out this hotel. Dude, legit, now it makes me feel like there's just dust out there. Yeah, <laughs> Alright, we're just leaving Dufer now. We're headed to France, Oregon now. So, probably the ghost town. You ready, babe? Yeah. It's gonna be so much fun. This is gonna be great. Alright, check you guys over there. Don't mind this really tight sweater. So we just made it to friends. A lot, a lot, it's a less, less of a ghost town than I thought. But there is this old school here. Go check it out. Wow. Yeah, so I'm guessing they look 19 built in 1909. Yeah, it says it up there. Damn, dude. Check this out, guys. Wow. <laughs> really? He probably he probably feels sees ghosts. That's what I'm saying. Forever and always. Ah, it's cold. It is cold here. Hey, I'm on a place. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> I wonder when this building will like sooner or later just fall. It's their like anniversary. First picnic at school. I think they must have been hey, there. Do you guys see oh, the great work of the fucking carpenters at it? <laughs> oh shoot. Yeah, don't yeah, let's not get too close because there's literally holes in there. No fuck that. They put, yeah, it goes like straight. They put that piece of wood so nobody opens it. For a reason. I think some people don't jump in. Get in there. There's something Imagine there. you see some crusty 1909 shit. It scares Wait. me. Really? This Imagine. is the one Shrek and Donkey Yeah, Dracula. bro. This is the one Shrek, Shrek used. <laughs> Wait, I look you want to just see. Bro, this one's bougie. A ver. No, no she... Mira, it's better than the one that the Lost Lake, yeah. Yeah, has toilet paper and everything. Hasta tiene una chimney, un calentón, güey. Let's go check out the hand sanitizer. People use this. I'm pretty sure it's just like a season. This one's bougie too. Really? Shut up, they don't everything. 
Hey, look, there's a fancy, uh, there's a nice little windmill over there. Oh, no. you're an old one. You see, you know what this reminds me of? That windmill, kind of like the the fucking. Have you guys ever seen uh, Jeepers Creepers? Yeah. Yeah, like that. So maybe the store clerk at the at, at, in Dufer was a little a little right. All we found right now is this little this little church right here, or this little school right here. And there's really nothing else out here. There's a little, there's like a little abandoned building over there, but it's fenced off because it looks like it's someone's like private property. I could fly the drone over there, but I'd probably get shot. But yeah, there's like a general store over there that we can't go see. And then there's some people living over there. Some kids playing volleyball. If the, if the cops came from over there, then <laughs> uh, maybe maybe not. I don't know because the cops came over there. We can just call it. I mean, we saw like main ghost town. All right, let's go. All right. For now, I think I think this concludes our ghost towns trip. Oh look, another cop coming. You see that? We're not going that way. <laughs> no, can, I, no, so there's no, there's a lot. There's cops coming. But all right, well we're gonna get out of here. Why are there so many cops? Coming? No, mom is more. Let's go. So sorry for that awkward uh, ending. Ending but while we were there at the ghost town. So what happened is, as I was in there kind of getting my beef footage and getting that, all that extra stuff I needed, two cops came up from this random road and yeah. like kind of passed by where we were parked. So I freaked them out. I didn't know until they told me, but they called me out saying like time to go. To like start getting ready to go. Next thing I know, like five, fuck, five state police start coming up that same road. Yeah. And now I'm like, what the hell? They're all just dipping out. And like, we're, and like we were just like parked and like all of a sudden it's like three are pulling up at the same time down and like one of them even got into the gravel of the church so like obviously hearing like a cop coming into the gravel and you're just like all right like y'all being a little too much right now and like and it's a tourist area so and like if you go inside i mean you'll see in the footage that like there's people like have that have writings everywhere so it's like a very tourist area and like not a lot of people may like come but either way it was just like a little weird but we did check on maps up that hill. There was like a little building. So maybe they have like their headquarters, or like, I'm not headquarters, but like. Yeah, exactly. They have, I think they have like their headquarters or some sort of like place where they keep their trucks. Yeah. But it's the, when I was recording that last part. Sorry. Like, oh, you're good, babe. I, when I was recording that last part, like next thing I know, like two, three cops cars just kind of like park in front of where like the exit is. And like I couldn't tell if they're like looking at us or what's up, so like that's why I, like I was kind of like spaced out looking over there. I was like fucking shit myself, so we just thought it was better. We just like cut it. Okay. I think that 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 really concludes our uh, ghost adventure trip. I think we're gonna run some errands with my boy George right now, and then probably just pick up some dinner. I don't know. Maybe it will record when we pick up KFC and go see the kids. Up to you. Maybe we can add that on. We'll see. But till then. Thanks for coming to us on this adventure. This is Beto. This is Sara. And we'll catch you later.